Today we're here demonstrating a really unique procedure that uh, we love here at Infinity Cosmetic Associates. It's what we call a micro laser peel. It's a very powerful tool where we use a, an actual erbium laser to do a very light laser resurfacing, hence the term micro laser peel. Just to give people an idea of the depth that we're going when we're actually resurfacing the, uh, the skin of this patient right here, we're only going about 10 to 15 micrometers deep in the skin. So give, to give our patients an idea what, how deep that is, a typical microdermabrasion might only take off the top three to four micrometers of skin. So it's just like a, kind of like a microdermabrasion on steroids is what I call it. So it's a, it's a very superficial chemical peel that gives our patients, takes off the superficial dead layers of skin and just a little bit deeper to help combat fine lines, fine wrinkles, pigmentation, and uh, the recovery is actually very, very quick. Most of our patients, uh, after having these uh, micro laser peels, typically recover over a 24-hour period, and then they're able to put a mineral-based makeup on or a light foundation and uh, get back to work really, uh, you know, usually within 48 hours. Of course, there are definitions of the micro laser peel. Some doctors might do a micro laser peel of 10 micrometers. Other doctors might still consider it a micro laser peel if they go up to 20 micrometers. Clearly, the, the, the 20 is going to give the patient a little bit more downtime than the 10 micrometers. Here at Infini, you can see that we really concentrate on patient safety with protecting the eyes. When we get up around the eyes, we really try to get close up underneath the eyes and around the sides of the eyes to get up on the uh, crow's feet and the fine little wrinkles that, uh, that uh, really pester people right around their eyes. Now we're on the other side, uh, ablating or, or burning off those superficial layers. We do use a smoke evacuator when we do this treatment, so you can't see that here in the video, but there is uh, the smoke plumes that are generated from, from burning that skin off uh, are just sucked up in a little uh, uh, sterile filter on a smoke evacuator. The procedure is actually very quick and uh, believe it or not, with that low level of resurfacing, it's extremely comfortable. We don't typically give our patients any sedation or any drugs with this, with this superficial type of resurfacing, and I don't believe I've ever had a patient not tolerate this low level of resurfacing. Clearly, when, when, when we go a lot deeper and we have to do resurfacing of upwards of 50, 100, 200 microns uh, in depth, then we will give people sometimes a little bit of Vicodin or a little bit of Valium to take the edge off uh, and help with pain control during the procedure. Here you can see we're blending in the, the resurfacing down to just underneath the jawline so that there's no demarcation lines uh, seen during the procedure. I think that's a very key element of resurfacing to go below the jawline when you're doing resurfacing.